Yes. You can move the grippers up and down. Twist it a bit, a bit sideways. Yeah, so it's super neat. Hi guys, today we are putting together a robotic arm. So yeah, I got this on Amazon. It came partially pre-assembled. This is a six degree of freedom robotic arm with six servo motors. One, two, three, four, five, six. You can also assemble this yourself. I got this from Timu for $30. It also came with like all the server motos, six server motos and all the parts you need to assemble so you can do it yourself or just be like me, be lazy and just like buy it partially pre-assembled. I'm going to assemble the USB-C camera, the processor, the motherboard. These are the like main components to like be able to program this. This also came with a controller. You can like play around with it with this um, when it's assembled, obviously. We have a screwdriver here as well. Let's get started. Yeah, so it has the suction cups that you have to put through here. So put together the section, suction cups at the bottom so this stays put. And screw it in. This tiny, tiny, tiny screws right here. Now we've installed the suction cups. We are going to screw this copper pillars that will hold the motherboard so it's gonna go somewhere like this this is gonna be screwed on top of here okay yeah we are done here we have these attached to the base of the robotic arm okay my wings are so terrible though. we're gonna screw this processor on top of this people all screws right here are installed now we're going to install the processor right here it has to be installed in this particular direction and just push it in very gently easy peasy now we have the processor right here on the motherboard so now we have the camera mount installed we're going to install this camera right up here now we have the camera installed up here right here above the robotic arm so the camera is all set good to go now that we've fully set up the robotic arm let's wire things up first we have this receiver for the controller which would help us control the robot and it's gonna go right here the receiver goes right here stick it in i feel like this overall is just like very neat the way it's packaged and so you don't have to source for all the parts uh, <clears throat> next you have like the wire for the camera here a usb wire my computer is a mac so i have a usb to usb c converter right here so i'm gonna plug the camera into the usb port we have a micro usb wire right here it's also gonna go into the computer to power the motherboard so plug the micro usb right here so i'm gonna plug micro usb in here as well now we're all fully connected. There's also a 12 volt power supply here to supply all the extra needed power for this. Um, and I plug that in right here. Okay, yeah, we're all wired up. You can see all the lights are turned on. This is the transmitter plugged in. It's connected to this controller. And now I can control the robot arm with this controller right here. It transmits what position each of the motors is meant to move to so yeah uh this is the part one of this video just the assembly and getting it to work with the controllers and the part two i'm going to go over programming the robotic arm and integrating some ai features with the camera so stay tuned for that video and thank you for watching